We got a best guard blade. Look at it. Uh, uh, uh. Oh wait, pins are on. I thought I had those off. Boom. Can peel that sticker off. I just might. If I don't get a battery, because the battery's supposed to come with it. But we're gonna keep on keep it moving. Lipo, uh less than or greater than twenty we'll just we pretend we never saw that. Full alloy chassis, 3650, 30, 3300 KV, 3650, hobby wing, 50 amp, man, little chip box 4 channel, waterproof though, hockey puck, hardware, we got a goof ass controller, that pulls off, and then, Put some triple A's in there. I haven't had any controller batteries go dead, so I'm not gonna complain on anything ever. Uh. Oh, this controller's pretty cool though. It has your basic dual rate trim, but it has my favorite feature, a low battery warning. Yeah. Uh, forward reverse function, so you can use this receiver on something else. Pretty sweet wing. All right, let's see what this looks like next to the nitro. And this is 16 inches long, 13 inches wide. The nitro is 11 inch, little 11 and a half, 11.6 inches wide, and 21 point something inches long. That's uh, that's I think that's bumper to bumper, but the wheelbase is shorter. This also seems to have hardened steel screws all over the down place. I just figured, I assumed you know it had steel uh, axles and diffs and all that. It does come with extra A-arms with pins. I like this though. Warranty accessories, upgrading accessories, 50% off discount. This RC also has a slipper clutch right here. Here's how we control the nuclear fusion. 2S. Oh, nice lights. Oh yeah, we had one light going out here. Loose wires or some shit. Definitely loose wires. Come on. There we go. I had to put two up higher because the wing kind of blocks low sometimes. And it looks dope. But I didn't mean to put tape over it. Alright, let's go. I wanted to drive it out the back, but... I gotta get going. I'm too lazy. It's getting dark already. This thing does not need a gyro at all. Like, and they don't even have a center diff. Sitting up high, low, dedication to Ken Block. My number one inspiration. He's always been my favorite racer. Look at that, right around the corner. Oh, let's get over here and do some drifting. I wanted to hit those. We got plenty of battery. Let's do some drifting first. Where are we at? Right here. I can drift in front of us and outside. Oh, woo, car coming, truck coming. I don't know, I see him. So blade, ain't it? Just hits the bumps. Oh, I wonder if I could jump over that. That's a big hill. It's gonna want a nosedive, it's so steep. 
try it out here. Oh. Almost. We're going to get up that. Almost. Oh, I had to see our top speed too. In the snow. About 20 degrees out. 26.8. About 30 mile an hour 2S right out the box. Ooh, that was a hard hit. Oh, almost. Nice. There we go. Go, baby, go. Go. Oh, we did it. Here we go. Go, 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 go. Go, 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 go. Oh. Limp mode. That was a hell of a run time. And she's done. Ladies and gentlemen, the Beskar Blade. Badass. Full size, one tenth. Same size as a Stampede or all that jazz. Yo, know, this thing is badass. I really recommend it. Especially if you got it on a sale. You gotta steal. He <laughs> just robbed Besgar Amazon. This thing is a Red Cat Volcano. You all know that. It's badass. You can put any kind of body on it, one tenth. Um, it's it's really light, fast. You don't gotta do nothing to it. Just tape the body, wrap a strap, you're good. Lots of videos.